Hey, what's going on guys? Jake the Happy Snake here, and welcome to my Banjo-Kazooie permadeath. This is the first permadeath that I've ever done on my channel, and I am very excited for it. Now, the main reason why I am doing this permadeath is basically due to COVID-19. I am now out of work for at least two weeks now because where I live is in a state of emergency. So, yeah, I have a lot of spare time on my hands. So I figured, why not start another series? I was planning on doing this at some point in the future, but I just didn't realize that it was going to be this soon. And I know I just finished my my last Let's Play of this game, like a couple of weeks ago, but again, this is the best time for me to do this because I have so much extra time on my hands. So yeah, this is going to be a lot of fun. In case you guys don't know what a permadeath is, basically if I die once, then the series is over. That's, that's literally what it is, so I really can't die at all. And to make this a lot more challenging, I am not going to be getting any of the honeycomb pieces. So I'm going to be playing through the entire game with just five honeycombs. So that's going to make this a lot more tough, but you know what, I'm ready for it. It's, it's, it's going to be fun. And uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing how far I'm going to get. I'm really not expecting to actually complete this. I'm just, I just kind of want to see how far I can get without dying. So, yeah, and how I'm going to be doing this is I'm going to be getting six Jiggies every part. Now, I know that's not going to be even because there's 100 j Jiggies in the game. So, uh, that leaves four Jiggies. So, once I have 96, I will just be getting the last four Jiggies in one video. So, that'll be, I think that'll be the second last video of the of the series if I, if I actually make it that far. Uh, so, yeah, I think that's the best way to do it. Get six Jiggies per video. And, uh, yeah. So, this is the file that I used for my first Let's Play this game, that which I did last summer. This is the file I used for my last Let's Play, which I just finished a couple of weeks ago, and this is the file that, uh, yeah, I, this is like my third attempt doing this, so I'm just gonna erase this right now. There we go. Alright, here we go. So yeah, this is the file that I'm gonna be using for my permadeath, and I don't really think there's much point of showing this intro a third time, so we're gonna skip it. And in my first attempt at making this video, like I said, this is my third attempt, my first attempt I actually learned how to skip the text. I knew there was a way to do it, I just had no idea how to, but now I do know how to. So, it's gonna make this go a lot faster, although we can't skip this text, unfortunately. Okay, press B. Alright. Thank you, bottle. So yeah, I am not gonna be getting any honeycomb pieces, so I can literally just go right to the top. Spiral Mountain, which I'm not used to. I'm used to going around here and getting all the all the, all the honeycomb pieces, but I am not going to be doing that. So, so yeah. So I'm going to actually see how far I can go without getting hurt one time, since I really since getting hurt once is actually a uh, a bad thing. So yeah. All right. So you're ready to tackle the witch. I keep forgetting I can do this. I keep forgetting that I can skip the text. Alright, so yes, six jiggies per video, and the first jiggy is actually at the very start here. And we have another cutscene. And skip that one too. There he is. The fun begins! My tricks and traps, we'll see who wins! Yeah, like I said, it's my third attempt. Plus, I've been playing this game a lot lately. So yeah, go and find a picture with a piece missing. Okay, that is the first Jiggy. So one down, 99 to go! I feel like I said that in my first Let's Play. I don't know. I was gonna say, eventually I might actually hold the record of doing the most Adventure Kazooie Let's Plays on my channel, but that's not true, because I remember that there's Timothy Bobo, who has, who has speedrun how, how do you sped run speed run who's done a speed run there we go who's done a speed run of this game like i don't know how many times a bunch okay stop there we go the door to mumbo's mountain is open all right let's get started on this This is actually gonna be hell. It really is. Like, to beat this game with with only five honeycombs, this is gonna be tough. Because I've never actually done this at all with the regular, with the most honeycombs that you can get. So, to do this with five honeycombs, it's gonna be, it's definitely gonna be a chore. 
Okay. Alright, get that first Jinjo. And believe me, I'm not gonna cheat or anything. The first time I die is the first time I'm gonna die. I'm not gonna, like, restart. Uh, restart the recording if I die. I'm not, I'm not gonna do that, believe me. I'm not that kind of person. Alright, there's a honeycomb piece up there just taunting me. And I'm gonna be saving a little bit of time, too, getting the honeycomb pieces, which is quite nice. Now, a lot of them are really aren't that hard to get, but... I won't have to worry about getting them in this world, so that's kind of nice. Alright, come here, you bull. You're full of bull crap, eh? Oh, are you still- I was gonna see how far I could- Okay, no. No. I am- <laughs> I was gonna try to see how far I can go without getting hurt, and I clearly didn't, didn't, uh... I, I didn't make, I didn't make it that far at all, but whatever. Alright. Grab this orange. Oh my gosh. Really? I don't think I've ever gotten hurt by that guy before. Like, not by the oranges, but like, by just by getting hit, like, 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 physically. Like, actually, like, touching him and getting hurt. I don't think I've ever actually, it's happened before. Alright, go. I keep forgetting that I can skip the text. There's, there's naked Diddy Kong over there, just waiting for me. Alright, so that's two. Okay, no, shut up! I don't need you to talk to me. This, is, this kind of feels like a speedrun, too. I know it's not a speedrun, but it kind of feels like it because I'm just skipping everything. Like, if you want to watch a just a nice Let's Play of this game uh, on my channel, this is not the one to watch. Like this is um if you wanna watch if you wanna watch one, watch one of the first two. I would actually kinda recommend the second one because first of all it's a, there's a face cam and I'm actually using a controller and um, I feel like it's just better to watch. The first one I'm using a keyboard. And so yeah, it's pretty hard to watch me play through this game with a keyboard. Like, oh my gosh. And no, no, I need the ground pound. I always come over here with the ground pound. I need it, and I don't have it, so. Like, honestly, this is- I'm just doing this because I really don't have a whole lot of other things to do. I'm gonna eventually run out of, uh, you know, if I- I could do the daily video of Pokemon Silver or Super Mario 64, but I'm eventually gonna run out of it. Like, I'm, like, I'm gonna run out of time. Or not run out of time, but I'm gonna not have enough to do, so that's why I figured I'd just do this, just to kind of keep me busy. Oh, shoot! Do I have to do this- do I have to do that again? I really hope not. Do I have to do that again? Okay, good. Just want to make sure I didn't have to hit him uh, two times again. Okay. Whoop de doo! Alright, that's three, so that's four together, so I can get two more. So. There's one up here, and there's one on the other side, so that will be good, I think. Hello, Bottles! Give me the Talon Trot! It's the most useful move in this game, in my opinion. Alright. <sighs> nope. The camera in this game really gets on my nerves. In case you didn't know that. Like, seriously, the camera in this game just drives me absolutely bonkers. Alright. So, I can get one more. I've gotten four so far here, right? And five all together, so I can get one more. So, I'll grab the orange Jinjo. I mean, if you think about it, if I was to do this permadeath with the uh, regular honeycombs, I, there's a good chance I could do it because in my second, le like in my second last play of this game, the one I just finished, I only died one time, and it wasn't at the part that I normally die, die at, which is Grunty's Furnace Fun. I always die there, but I didn't die in in, in my last last play. I actually died doing something really stupid in Cliff Clock Wood. Uh, that's how I died. And if I didn't die there, then I would have actually gone to the entire game without dying once. And I didn't restart. Like I didn't accidentally die or anything, and then just restart. I I, I actually didn't. It was all legit, which is pretty cool. So yeah. Um, so, the fact that I've never done it, 
with the normal honeycombs, ugh, I don't know, it's gonna be tough. The, if I make it to the final, if I actually make it to the final boss, eh, boy, that's gonna be quite the chore. Now, I don't actually know if you can get the red honeycombs, um, with, uh, I don't know if you can get the, I'm not sure if you can get the red honeycombs with, uh, the, you know, the, um, like with only having five. I've never done that before, so I'm not actually sure, so if I actually make it to that point, I guess we'll find out. Um, I'm gonna grab the rest of the, I know I got the last jiggy that I need for this video, but I'm just gonna grab the rest of the notes here, and then I will end off this video. Is that it? Okay, that's it. Alright guys, so that's it for this video. Thank you very much for watching. Next time, I'm gonna get six more jiggies, and finish up this world. Uh, I got five here? Yeah, I got five here, so I'm gonna get, um, I'll be getting... Uh, the last five plus the first one, Treasure Treasure Trove Cove. So that's what I'm going to do next time. So thanks guys for watching. I really appreciate it. And I will see you all next time. Tomorrow night at 7.30 p.m. I'll see you all then. Peace!